Hey everyone, welcome to the new vlog on MNR Vlogs. Today's my first day where I'm not supposed to buy Lego all month. It's March 1st. Although I thought the date was going to show up there. Anyway, like the video. If you guys do enjoy the vlog series, really helps out. Anyway, um, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to go to Walmart and I'm going to get a new extension cable. So I've been running this extension cable from there all the way across my floor. And then it goes up my shelf and finally up to that lamp. And I need that lamp there. It's a great source of lighting for my reviews and just for my room. And I feel like I want a little bit more dimly lit room, but still decently enough with the natural lights. And I don't know, I, I feel like I need that. So I'm going to get a different extension cable and rewire this because this just looks awful, right? Like we all agree, like it just does. There's no way around it. It's also like old and dirty. So that's another reason I want a new one and probably a shorter one. I'm basically going to rewire it. It might go right down the center there. And then there's actually an outlet right there that I'm going to wire it into. So we're going to have to take a lot of Lego sets off the shelf to accomplish that, but we're going to get it done. Let's go to Walmart and see what we can find. I'm also finally rocking a different colored watch band. I've been wearing the white one for like two months and I just haven't been feeling like changing it. Like I feel like the white kind of matches everything, but today I'm wearing black and white. So I figured I'd spruce it up with a little bit of color. I'm not supposed to buy any Lego this month, but here I am on the Lego aisle looking anyway. There's nothing new, so I'm not gonna buy anything. Don't worry. So Jared and I are working on a project right now. Uh, this is also going to be going along with Republic Bricks. So we'll probably be like the three main people involved. And all I got to say is y'all should be excited. More information coming soon. I'm going to start working on my uh, wiring that I said I was going to do because I did buy a cable at Walmart here. Six foot extension cable. So this will go nicely up along my wall in black. It should be a lot cleaner than what I have now where it just runs across my floor. So I think I'm going to work on setting that up right now. So I'm going to clean up this whole area, possibly dust some of those bottom shelves, and then we're going to put in this new extension cable again. It's going to go from there up to the lamp light thing there, and maybe I'll like tape it up against a wall or something. I got to see what works. All right, so getting some much needed spring cleaning done. The Saturn V is something I want to put right in between here, and it will fit. I just need to separate these shelves a little far away for a minute so that I can fit it in between and then close it back up. That's the plan. So now everything is in place. This is gonna be perfect for videos now. The wire is nicely hidden behind the shelf here. I got it taped up to the back there so that the wire basically follows the, the thing down. So on camera, when the camera's like this, you won't see it. It's a little off center, so I'll fix that a little bit. But now it's pretty much perfect. I mean, that is quite a setup. Reviews are gonna look something like this with the table table there obviously so it should look pretty dang clean now i'm really excited with that new uh lineup for the wire and everything no longer do i have a wire stretching across my floor here that's been there for like two or three months now and finally i'm like well, all i need to do is spend like five dollars to fix that i'm so dumb that was such a quality of life some basketball just did Fortnite friday jared and i are working on a secret project you might have just got a very like i don't know i might have edit that out we'll see and uh, I'm just working on my shelves right now. I haven't redone my shelves in a long time, so it feels good. I'm actually going to pull out some of my Harry Potter stuff that I've been keeping in here and put that on the shelves because I figured I'd spruce it up a little. We got some Lego Movie 2 there. Just getting a little extra from Star Wars. We got Speed Champions, a little extra outside of Star Wars just because. I'm on Jin Blade's live stream with a bunch of people right now. And uh, I just added this new sign to my wall. Uh, I just had this idea while we were chatting. And this is days since last Lego purchase. It's at one right now and I'm gonna update it every day. It's gonna be beautiful. I've made a lot of progress on my shelves. It's about 1 a.m. now. I'm still on the live stream with everyone there. And we are just getting everything done. I gotta find a place for this, I think, because I do want to display this. But I kind of filled up all the shelves and didn't realize that I needed a spot for this. So what are you gonna do? We'll find something for it. So right now I'm on Gin Blades live stream. They're doing like a 24 hour thing. And then next I'm going on Brickatex live stream and that'll be it. Just kind of cleaning up my table so I can finally film my Moss Eisley Cantina review. Got some sets that I want to build tonight on Brickatex stream over there, kind of laid out. Still, And then I want to also review the Lego Movie 2 minifigures. And then this is the other shelf I need to clean up. I think I'm going to do a room tour soon. People have been asking for a room tour. I clean up these shelves. They look awesome. I need to do over there and I need to do this and in my closet. But like, I think I'm going to do a room tour soon. People have been asking for a room tour. I'm feeling like my room looks pretty good and uh, it's getting there. So room tour coming soon, maybe. So I was just dusting the ship and uh, I broke it. Like it literally just cracked. Dang. That's a, uh, wow. I can't believe that actually just happened. It just cracked. I felt it get loose and I tried to like put it back together 
and it wouldn't go back together. The whole thing there just cracked, which is a real shame. So I guess I'm going to have to uh, figure out how to order some new ones from Bricklink or Lego, but I can't buy Lego for a month. So what am I supposed to do? I guess I'll just put it up as is right now, and then uh, I will worry about it later in the month or something. That's a shame, dude. That is a crying shame. I love that set. So right now I'm live streaming with Brigitech and all the fellows there. Uh, we're on Brigitech's channel, so having a great time. But I did notice something. I just built this, and um, what I found interesting about it is that this is a re-release or a remake. It's pretty much more of a re-release. And the Darth Vader's TIE Fighter, you can see in the box there, no dome piece on top. But here it has the dome piece. So LEGO didn't even bother to update the box art for the new set when they straight up re-released it with like one small change. I can't believe it. So it is way, way, way too late. It's almost 3 a.m. I've done all the live stream stuff with Jim Blade and Lego Freak and Bricktalot and Brickitect. And I just got an email from the Lego creator, not Lego creator, the YouTube creator, you know how it's late, the, the YouTube creator support guy. And he's like, hey, here's your uh, YouTube play button code. So I'm getting my play button. Sweet, I was going to go to sleep, but now i got to go ahead and submit everything for this so that I can get this as soon as possible. Oh, man, I'm going to have a play button. Where am I going to put it? I didn't even think about that. It's got to be in the background of my videos, right? So it's got to go, like, back over there. Jared and I are working on some top secret stuff, but we also recorded a video earlier on the new LEGO Avengers Endgame set. Some very cool stuff came out of this, Hall of Armor and the Avengers Compound Battle, which I think a lot of people are going to really like, especially the Hall of Armor for whatever reason. I think that set's pretty neat. And, of course, you guys can check out the video on the main channel. It's already out by the time you're seeing this vlog. And I also need to update my days since last LEGO purchase because it's now three. We've made it three days, baby. It's about 10 p.m. right now. I just finished filming Ask Governor Productions, and I feel like all I've done, I woke up about about, I don't know, 9 a.m. All I've done all day is make YouTube videos. I think I made my former review. I made my Lego Moss Eisley Cantina review, the 4501 set. I made Ask Him in Our Productions, and I, of course, made the Avengers video. Four videos in one day takes a lot longer than you would think. You know, you look at a video, it's like, oh, that video is only 10 minutes long. Well, it probably takes like an hour and a half, two hours to make. <laughs> like, it sometimes depends on the video, obviously, but. Yeah, and I still got to edit Ask Eminar in the morning so we can go up tomorrow and then Eminar News, Bricks and Bits. Ah, it's all piling up again. At least I'm being productive to start the week. Also, peep the four days since last Lego purchase. It's official. Or at least in the morning it'll be. I just updated it anyway. So, that, you know, I'm not going to buy anything while I sleep, I think. I'm playing rank play and working on YouTube videos. Watch this dude. Oh my god. One. Two. Oh, <laughs> he did him dirty. Oh my God, we're all tied up 2-2, baby. Let's go. Out in my garage grabbing some stuff, and we almost had a disaster with the Nabu fighter here. It almost, it almost fell right on down. I actually lost the antenna that goes on the back of it. It went way down there. We'll have to get that another time, but come on here for the resistance bombers. You're telling me the Celtics are actually winning? Can you believe it? Bro, this is crazy. The Celtics season has been such a downer, but this game feels like it might actually be the turning point. Like, the Celtics might actually be good like they're supposed to be. Oh my god, it feels so good. I'm almost done editing Ask Em, or Em in our news, rather. Get in the hole. Oh! Holy crap, dude. They're running them off the court. Of course I'm watching the Celtics game. I watch all the Celtics games. It is Wednesday morning and the Lego room is pretty dang clean. You can see I vacuumed the floor. This part still needs to be cleaned up a little. I don't really know what to do with all, uh, all these boxes. I might throw some of them away. Uh, we do need to get the slave ones very soon because it's almost time to do the comparison videos on those. But other than that, looking pretty good. Just got done filming a bit for a Lego Star Wars comparison video. There are a lot of Lego pieces on the ground. It, uh, yeah, well not Lego pieces, actually fake Lego pieces because I destroyed a fake Lego TIE Fighter. I'll show you guys. Yeah, you can see that thing got thoroughly destroyed and will not be getting and will not be being rebuilt. Vlog time. I just opened up this very cool. I believe it's from 1999. It was a Target and Frito R2D2 promo. Very similar to the UCS one. Obviously, still quite different because it's about 13 years uh, before that one came out. But yeah, it's really dirty. So I kind of got to clean it up. It's like nasty dirty to a point. But 80 bucks for something this old and rare. I'm very happy with. 
Tonight is going much like last night. I'm watching the Celtics and editing YouTube videos. Doesn't get better than that, to be honest. Hey, it's the president. Let's go. You see, sometimes I don't learn my lesson. I think I just learned my lesson. That is a decapitated Y-Wing. That doesn't just happen. You see, yesterday, when I was messing around with my lights, I put one, or maybe it was the other day, I put one up here, and I noticed it started to slowly fall to the right. So I was like, all right, hey, I'll move that. So I, today, put one here. I guess I gave it a little bit too much of a lean one way to the other. And that's how you end up with a light. Falls down, hits your shelf, somehow misses the biggest Lego set on the shelf, and decapitates your, your poor Y-Wing. So, with that being said, I think I've learned my lesson. I think I avoided a complete disaster. I really did. I, like, I think the Y-Wing is the only th set that got, like, that's actually amazing that the Y-Wing is the only set that got damaged by that falling. I'm bringing all this stuff out so I can build my Creator Mustang that I got in the mail today. I'll show that to you guys. I don't think I showed it to y'all yet, but pretty lucky with the boxes here. It looks like Unikitty is all right. Yeah, just parts for the Y-Wing down here. So this is my biggest test yet on the clearance aisle. A green ninja mech dragon for $21. All the, the other two are regular price. I don't know why they're here, but I really, really want to buy this. Although I know I don't really want it. Like it's one of those that's just on clearance, right? 21 bucks. Well, I don't want it. I just, I don't, I don't know what to do, dude. I'm not going to buy it. I've already made up my mind. I'm not going to buy it. That's a really good price for peace, but God, I don't need any more Lego sets. Unless they're new Star Wars sets, of course. I'll get those, but I think we're going to walk on it. We're going to be the strong person here. So I just finished my Fortnite Friday live stream. I also did build my Creator Mustang today. I finished building it today. I built the first two bags yesterday. I built the last six today. So this is what we have for the Creator Mustang now. Pretty good looking model. Really like it. Going to do my review of it for Monday. So a couple of sets I got to review there on the table. I also did get some rubber bands in the mail. Where did I put those? Rubber bands go for the Tantive 4 there. They're supposed to go on there. The other ones that I had on there snapped because they were just old and brittle. So bought some new ones. I also got some new ones for the TIE Bomber that I got, so. But I think that's gonna be all for this Lego vlog. I don't really have much else I'm doing tonight, so just gonna work on some video stuff. But if you guys did enjoy, leave a like on the video. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe to m &R Vlogs. And let me know what you guys thought of this video. If you had anything to say about this video, leave in the comment section below. And I'll see you all again next week, Saturday at noon Eastern for another vlog. Deuces.